this is our presentation on performance horse nutrition by Christine Stefan and Aaron Fitzgerald. Now we're going to talk about the requirements of a mature maintenance horse. Maintenance requirements of a mature horse include basic nutrients such as proteins, fats, fiber in the form of roughage, starches and sugars, as well as key vitamins and minerals. The mature horse should consume anywhere between 1.5 and 2% of his body weight per day. This can be divided between forages and concentrates. The minimum amount of forages the horse should consume a day is 1%, but usually it's between 1.5 and 2%. Concentrates usually make up 0 to 0.5% of his body weight per day. The number one key nutrient in all living things is water, and this is especially important for horses. Now we're going to delve into the details of feeding a performance horse. Our main goals for feeding these performance horses is to maximize performance by providing adequate energy, replenishing nutrients required for muscle function and repair, and to support optimal health through a balanced diet. Now we're going to talk about fats in the performance horse diet. Fat contains 2.25 times more energy than an equal quantity of carbohydrate and is the most abundant source of stored energy in the horse's body. Fats also provide essential fatty acids, which are important components of all cell membranes and are vital for skin, coat, and hoof health, as well as certain aspects of the immune system. Good quality sources of fat include vegetable and marine oils, flaxseed, and rice bran. Fatty acids are involved in the glycogen sparing effect. Glucose, which is stored in the muscle tissue as glycogen, and is stored until utilized in the anaerobic activity. Fatty acids are used during the aerobic activity, sparing glucose for the fat, faster anaerobic activity. Now on to another important nutrient, protein. People would think that there would need to be an increase in protein in high-performance horses. However, this is not true. The excess protein that is not absorbed or utilized is broken down to nitrogen, and excreted as ammonia in the urine. The total protein concentration in performance horses should be kept between 10 and 16 percent. Certain amino acids, such as lysine, threonine, and methionine, have been identified as major components of muscle protein and are essential for growth, proper muscle development, and muscle repair. Last, we will discuss starches, electrolytes, and probiotics and their importance in the performance horse. Low levels of dietary starches reduce lactic acid and pr acid production, lower the instances of colic and ulcer formation. It also provides lower post-feeding blood levels of glucose and insulin, resulting in calmer horses. Electrolytes are not stored by the body and must be provided to replenish what is lost in sweat. Maintaining the correct levels are essential to support the horse's thirst reflex, proper neuromuscular communication, and muscle contractility. Probiotics or yeast cultures can increase the breakdown in the hindgut, enhance availability of phosphorus and magnesium. It can also improve the hair coat, reduce colic risk by maintaining a higher pH and lower last levels. Here's an example of a performance horse ration. This ration came from an FEI level show barn, but we have been asked to not disclose which barn this information came from. This ration is for a nine year old warm blood stallion who is in intense training competing in FEI level classes internationally. As you can see, this diet follows pretty well what we've talked about earlier for requirements of a performance horse. One thing, thing, one thing to take note of is the Platinum Performance Supplement, which includes omega-3 and omega-6 fatty acids. Omega-3s reduce inflammation, improve joint function, allow for a better immune response to decrease the recovery time of a muscle tissue. Here we continue with the same horse and his diet for the rest of the day. His dinner includes multiple supplements. The Platinum Recover is used to help with the performance and recovery in intensely worked horses. The pelleted U-guard is a pelleted ulcer guard, which helps prevent the formation of ulcers. Horses that travel a lot are subject to ulcers, so this helps combat this problem. Another interesting component of this feed is the garlic. It has been shown to repel flies and insects during the muggy summer weather. The Vitaflex MSM has ingredients that is important for cartilage and joint health. Lastly, the electrolytes, as we talked about before, are supplemented to replace what is lost in sweat.